So our first lap of Australia is officially done and we're back in our home city of Perth. We had a few days catching up with mates and family before needing to get back out into nature. We're lucky enough to have access to a private farmland in beautiful Julema, which is about an hour northeast of the city. We spent some time just hanging out with Ollie and now Jack is back to tinkering with the troopy. Moment of truth guys, I just changed the starter motor, I reconditioned the starter motor and it took me so long. I've never done one before. So uh, we're going to find out right now if it's going to start. So what's been happening, it's a common thing with Land Cruisers apparently, you turn the key and it'll just make a click noise. I thought it was the battery, but it might be. I'm just going to find out. <laughs> Bang, started straight away. So it could be a flat battery as well, but I mean we, haven't, we didn't start the car overnight, so I don't know what it was, eh? Anyway, the car started. That means it didn't start a motor properly. We are going to head down there and we're going to pull back a massive log with the troopy we're going to put the troopy to the test because we've got some mates well, we've got my sister coming up to the property tonight and we're going to have a nice big fire and have a cook up smile that was just on your face before was <laughs> so funny. <laughs> the old uh, rigging ticket came in handy there. Hopefully that's enough wood. <laughs> Ollie, what are you and mum doing? What have you got yourself there, Megan? Megan's got her uh, monster chair. If you've never seen one of these before, they are the most comfortable chairs in the world. They're not ours. It's bigger than your, it's bigger than you. Jack's sisters, but oh my god. They're so, oh, always my underly. Look how big it is. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. So good. Classic. Anyway. We got two of them as well, so. I got the fire going, it's a bit smoky. Log's going well. I uh, just got some onions on the uh, pot. We're having, we're having spaghetti bolognese, eh? We're yeah. having pasta. We're having uh, pasta. Yeah, spaghetti bolognese. Oh, okay. oh, pasta with mince. We'll see how it goes anyway. <laughs> I don't know if like if you can call it that or if that has to be like the proper classic spaghetti bolognese. Or yeah, we're having pasta. We're waiting for my sister to come up. Um, they're taking their time. They're, they, uh, they're, they're those kind of people. The, the people that uh, say they're going to be there an hour from now, but they come five hours. <laughs> I'm sure everyone's got friends like that. But anyway, we're gonna wait for them. They're bringing some quad bikes up. Haven't I haven't ridden a quad bike for about six years or something like that. The last time I, Megan's never ridden one. So that's gonna be fun. So we'll uh, introduce you to those guys when they uh, get here. And for now, we're just gonna cook up some dinner. Alright, pasta's on. Getting pretty good on the old uh, campfire, aren't I? Yeah, it looks very professional. <laughs> um, my sister's not here yet, so uh, classic sister, always running late. We will uh, see us in the morning. We'll go for a bit of a quad bike ride and we're going to go check out Julemar State Forest. It's, it's not a, a very well known full drive track from what I've seen anyway. I haven't been there for 10 years and from memory it's, it gets pretty crazy. So. We're gonna go check it out, bring the quad, quad bikes down maybe, but uh, 
Yeah, we'll see how it goes. I'm pretty excited. Yeah, <laughs> I'm excited to get into this pasta. Can we yeah. eat without them? Yeah, we'll see you in the morning. We're <laughs> eating without them. Levi, say hello. Hello. This is Levi, guys. Um, all right, so we're going to teach Megan how to ride a bloody motorbike, and it's going to be very entertaining. Wait what for if I'm just like a boss at it straight away? <laughs> <laughs> Imagine Megan's hell good at it. <laughs> no, nah, it's, uh, it's, it's pretty hard, actually. No, it's not that hard. All right, Megan. Wait. You got your helmet on? Yes. Start her up. Can I stand here? Yeah. yeah. That's it. Okay. So you press that button there. You make press. sure it's in neutral. Just hold the button. Neutral's there. Yeah, it's, on, it's in neutral. Okay. So press it and hold it. What, this button? Yep. yep. That's but, it. Yeah. But hold on to that as well. <laughs> Go. Just with your thumb press that on, yeah. Pull this one all the way in. Pull the clutch in. All the way in. Remember to let go of the accelerator if you get stuck. You take off, slowly let go of it, and give it a little bit of rev. Tiny bit. Feel it start to move. There she goes, that's too much rev. That's it, keep the rev out, that's it. And when you want to stop, pull the clutch in. <laughs> <laughs> well, she got a whole uh, 10 metres. Yeah. And keep the bike running, you have to pull both of those in. Oh, both? Yeah. Okay. Oh, holy shit. Oh, right hey, there. buddy. She's, uh, she's learning quick, guys. <laughs> I think I'll jump on with you. Okay. I'm going to jump on with her and show her how it's done. Let's go. Yeah, because you're the expert. <laughs> right. oh, We're doing it, guys. She's doing it. How do you feel? Break the wing off, but I got spares in the car, so it should be all right. So you can fix it. Yeah, the gimbal's all right and all that. The old Mavic Pro lives to see another day. Look how dirty it is. So red. It's done, mate. <laughs> but uh, yeah, hopefully it still works. Pretty sure it does. We're going to head into Jewelamar State Forest now. We're going to pack up and uh, get away from these bloody flies. There's so many, eh? Hey? See you later. See ya. See you in Perth. Have a good one. See ya. Ciao. Alrighty, we're off to get ourselves into a bit of mischief in the state forest. It's so good having a farm stay out. Yeah, the car is already filthy though, so uh, oh, he's dead. definitely going to need a trip to the car wash after this. I think um, I think I should hit some mud holes. We've never actually done it in the trophy. Yeah. Like mud holes. We may as well since we it definitely well. needs a wash anyway. Okay, so we've, uh, after about 20 minutes of driving around, 30 minutes almost, we've come to where we want to be. But just before I show you what's uh, on the other side of the camera here, I just want to give 70 Series Land Cruiser owners a uh, shout out here. They sent us out these shirts. Megan, you want to show the back of it? Uh, go check out their website. It'll be in the description. Oh, I've ruined what we've come to. <laughs> but yes, <laughs> but yes, go check very, out the shirt. snazzy shirt. <laughs> There's a website in the description if you want one. And this is what we've come here for. One, two, three, four. Which one will it be? We're going to see how deep they are. But if they're too deep... Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> That's just going to keep going. That's yeah, really soft under there. If I had another car, I'd probably go for it. 
but um, it looks a bit deep, doesn't it? That one is not as deep, but it's, um, oh wait, nope. Yep, it's deep. Oh yeah. I might go down there, look. We'll go down there, have a look. A few ruts down there. Anyway, <laughs> we're uh, That's deceptive, we're hey? Gonna, <laughs> we're gonna do some contemplating. We do have a winch, so we, we can pull ourselves out, but. Yeah, but I what's mean, the point? <laughs> Megan doesn't get this I'm whole four-wheel driving thing. I get four, like, I've got, I like going four-wheel driving, but I feel like the, a destination at the end is the point of four-wheel driving. This well, sort of four-wheel driving, I don't understand. She finds it pointless. All you four-wheel drivers out there, <laughs> leave a comment down below and tell us why you love doing this stuff. Yeah, I know we'll get comments, but <laughs> me personally, like, you know, the destination is the no point way. to me. The destination of getting from here to the other side is the point, mate. <laughs> This is maybe the dirtiest the troopies ever been. Yep. Have a look at this. It's pretty bad. Oh man, these flies. Just have a look at this. Wait, they probably won't come to me now. They're everywhere. Are they coming? <laughs> yeah, they're coming. They congregate. Guys, we uh, we gave Julemar State Forest our best shot, but it's more suited to two or three vehicles. Yeah, I don't think because Ollie wasn't loving it very much no. either. Hey, hey buddy. Oh, he's had it, mate. It That's one thing with the troopy fit out we've got as well is um, 
this setup it's not, is not for him at nah, all. It's not suited to we having really, a dog. We really, really need to think about what we're going to do. Yeah. Instead, so. something needs to change. I don't know if um, we're going to pull the whole thing out and start from scratch or if we just need to figure out maybe yeah. like... Maybe we could put something here so he's got a bit more of a level, yeah. um, wider platform for him to be on. And then we're probably going to need something up the front near the cab to keep he him keeps back. Wanting to jump he wants in the to, front. yeah, or so he just wants to like cuddle us or some something. Some of you smart, know. smart cookies on there on YouTube, leave some comments down below if you've got any good ideas. Because Cause we really do love this setup. We like, love it's the setup. Perfect, but, but just it's not, not for good Ollie. for Ollie. It's yeah. not working. So. Leave a comment below if you have a very good idea or if you've got a dog with a troopy, it will help us so much. Yeah, but we're gonna do a few more trips around and see what doesn't work or yeah. what could possibly work. So yeah, stay tuned for next week. We're gonna be heading down south. Haven't really got any plan, probably just nah. go with the flow, but that usually works out pretty well for <laughs> it us. Be so. good. We'll see you next week, guys. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Yeah. Oh, oh. One, two, three, go! Hang on, uh, I'm picking my nose. Ew! Oh. Megan, put your helmet on. Push the goggles. <laughs> Push the goggles. <laughs> <laughs> what the f-